Hey everybody, so uh, back on Uncharted 4 again. Um, today we got 21 downs and 0 deaths, so figured I'd do some voiceover and uh, play the footage. So yeah, I was in the team though, so I tried doing uh, single games uh, beforehand this and it was all right but honestly sometimes the people you get paired with and matches you go solo it just doesn't turn out right so i was just using the copperhead the slowdown with the silencer this guy wasn't even playing at the beginning i don't know how i didn't kill him though got that guy i gotta get one more here yeah i finally get him One thing about the copperhead though, it sure chews through ammo. If you saw, I was already on the eight bullets. I just pushed this guy. He was already dead. Yeah, I got one guy down that rope. Well. She got me. She got me. Oh no, I got her. Too. And I just pushed really hard here. Finishing. Yeah, I think that was four of them right there. Since they put up that staff, that's why I'm facing the other way. Got a little too ambitious here. Genocide got my back though. I was gonna go for him, but then I was like, no, Genocide saved me there, so I feel him. Don't wanna get greedy. Got that guy there. Probably shouldn't have took cover. He could have probably survived. Now I didn't get her, but I got her little buddy who came in. She ran off after that. But the Drake comes in right here. And I smoke him. I still thought she was around the corner there, but she wasn't. She actually had gone around and flanked back towards that hallway. See, so yeah, I was still kind of nervous. I was like, I'm not going to push it until I know where she is, but she was gone. Now watch how fast this sniper goes down with the copperhead. I think I got landed all headshots once I started getting them going. Yeah. It's for first my aim was way too high and then yeah, that wasn't easy. The copperhead's actually pretty fast fire rate, so up close it kinda shreds too. Which is nice. So it's Pretty, it's not the greatest at long distance, but it'll get the job done sometimes. If the person's not moving a lot, but if they're moving, it's a catastrophe. But it is good when the other person's using a crevasse because it, the fire rate's so fast it kind of messes up their aim. Clever, but not clever enough. I'm unstoppable. I think the guys knew at this point we're definitely gonna win. So it was uh, 19 to 3. They actually, uh, if you see their mics moving, I think at this point they were saying that this team mostly left. And this guy actually gets me here with that nade. But check out this revive. He can like revive me immediately before I get back up there. That revive like saved my life. I 
I feel like reviving in this game is underrated because like when you revive someone they can get two or three more downs. My aim was way off there, kept bouncing all around. I think yeah, holy hell, I think he's he's the one with the clutch revives. Yeah, I was out of ammo here, so I know the egg is at long range, it's not gonna do shit, but I just wanted to distract them enough that our team could push in. This guy, he thought he was gonna get all crazy on me, but I just blind fired him so I could move. It wasn't that much of a competitive game. I thought it was more competitive than this, but they only got four uh, KOs at this point. We were just rolling it, mainly as a team. Yeah, I was just shooting it to clean it up. That one guy just left right there. He's like, yeah, no, I'm done. At that point, 14 downs. Yeah. I was going to get that ammo, but I really wanted that down. I never really scope in this bonfire. It's got such a quick rate of fire, it's just it's pointless to scope in that close because they're gonna be moving and shit. Like if your sensitivity is real high, you can do it, but I really don't wanna have my sense that high. It's just kind of a waste any further away. They were taunting on him there because I think he had an RPG and he was going to shoot Snake Eyes and Charmander. But, uh, I never got either of them. I draw this out. Look at the range on that. That 19 right there. Yeah, 19, no. So glad to meet you all. Sounds good with the RPG. I think he was going to get up and shoot again. So nice getting headshots with the cloud head. It's just, it seems a lot smoother. I think the game realizes more where the bullets are going. It seems like it's a gun that actually shoots straight too. Like the HS, I like the fast fire rate on the HS, but and the damage output, but the, um, the accuracy is just terrible. The AK-47, I feel like accuracy on it is less accurate than the or is more accurate than HS, but less accurate than the Copperhead. Yeah, that's my clip. 21 downs and zero deaths.